They're growing slow. <laughs> That's the main thing. They're slow. I mean, stuff, stuff a local farmer concerned about a strawberry crop following a stretch of cooler than usual temperatures. As Paul told us at 6, we've seen almost two full weeks of rainy days and nights. Farmers in the valley are glad to finally see warmer, drier weather in the forecast to help their crops. First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti takes a look. This is the busy season at Catalpa Grove Farm. Out front, customers are grabbing up all the spring flowers. But across the 150 acres off Route 14, it's a matter of keeping up with Mother Nature. We were ahead early. We had that really warm weather there, first part of April, the 80 degrees. That really pushed these plants. But the last couple weeks have seen rainy days and cooler than usual conditions that have slowed down the growing process. These berries, uh, considering where they are, I, I, normally they'd be further around, along you should be seeing some strawberry, small green fruit on there, and I really don't see much of that right now. Growers say this is probably the most sensitive time for plants like these, where the flower buds are beginning to show, and they're the most susceptible to the frost. At this stage of their growth, a hard frost can damage or even destroy a crop. To prevent that, crews stay out in the fields overnight, spraying a fine mist of water over the field to protect it. So as long as we continue to add water here to these plants, and we have a sprinklers that go around and cover them, it'll keep it right about 32 degrees, slightly above that. Mercer says with warmer, dry weather the next couple days, crews will start planting tomatoes and peppers. Other crops, such as corn, are already in the ground. As for these berries, he tells me with a few more weeks of good weather, the crop should arrive by the end of this month. In Columbiana County, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.